faces of these Notre Dame Irish players some disappointment and frustration. We'll circle back to, oh. That did not look good as Paige Becker's knee buckled. And now all of a sudden there's concern for the best player on UConn, who's lying in front of the Huskies bench in pain. And let's take a look at Beckers as she's bringing the ball up the floor. Watch just the ankle as she comes down. As she continues to try and go up, but she's still on the ground right now as her team surrounds her. This was the scene a moment ago here in stores. Paige Beckers was helped up, unable to put any weight on her left foot and had to be carried to the UConn bench by two of her teammates, where right now she's being looked at by the athletic trainer, Gina Oriema, standing nearby. We're in the final minute of a UConn win here, up by 18 over Notre Dame, and just a terrible development in this last minute for the reigning national player of the year. 73 to 54. Can't think of a more anticlimactic ending for what was a well-played game for UConn. Paige Becker's in tears being helped off the floor. Gina Oriem and Neil Ivey. Neil Ivey faced him many times as a player. UConn improves to five and one on the season. with more from stores after UConn's first win here in more than a year. UConn improves to 5-1, and one, a 19-point win at home over Notre Dame. Unfortunately, that's not the story here. Paige Becker's the reigning national player of the year in tears, walking off the court here at Gamble Pavilion. An apparent injury to her knee or ankle the final minute of the game and really just an awful feeling after what was a terrific afternoon here. Yeah, and without a doubt, that's where the focus and the mind and the hearts, I'm sure, of this UConn Huskies team are, and especially for this crowd, because Paige Beckers has been the instrumental part of what this team has done, not only this season and last season, but just for the individual herself. And it's not so much just about the team and about the program, but it's about just for her and how much work she's put into being the player she is and getting ready for the season. And we take a look at some of the highlights. She was terrific today on both ends of the floor. Generated so much activity on the defensive end and also hit some big time shots from the three point shot. And she was being aggressive. She was intense. And as you watch, I mean, going after loose balls, hustling, diving, getting on the floor. And a lot of this activity just came from her passion, determination. But this is the play that we're all going to continue to think about is you see Paige in tears being helped off by her teammates and certainly just hope the very best for her as we don't want to speculate what it is, but certainly does not look good at this point. Stats wise, a typical Paige Becker's afternoon at the office, 22 points, four assists, five steals. She also grabbed four rebounds. You see in those highlights how much energy she puts into this, how much she sacrifices her body and how much it means to her. It, 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 again, we don't want to speculate, but just that scene of her walking off in tears really leaves us with an empty feeling right now. Yeah, and it's all the intangibles she brings to the table. She is the unquestionable leader of this team, the best player in college basketball, and certainly we think the most and wishing her the very best.